Go. All right, so we're going to do the range of motion and strength testing for the ankle. You always do active range of motion first. You want to see what the limitations are of the patient. So you're going to ask the patient to pull your toes up towards you. High as you can go, 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 go. Cool, and so you're checking both sides to see if dorsiflexion is equal. Now point your toes down towards me. That's plantar flexion. Okay, now to point your toes inward towards each other. Perfect, that's inversion, and then point your toes away from each other. Good, that's in eversion. Okay, so that's active range motion. He looks good in all four directions. Now I'm gonna ask you to relax. I'm gonna pull your toes up for you. Okay, I'm gonna push him into dorsiflexion. I'm gonna pull your toes down into plantar flexion. I'm gonna flip my hands over to do inversion so I can control his foot a little bit better. Put his toes towards each other, nice inversion, and then go away for eversion. Okay, so range motion looks pretty normal. Now we're gonna test his strength. So you pull your toes up towards you. Now don't let me pull you down. I'm gonna pull down on dorsiflexion. I can't break them, that's a five out of five. Point down towards me, I push up. Can't break them, that's a five out of five. For inversion, I'm gonna put my fist here. I'm gonna have you squeeze. And then don't let me push you out. <laughs> that's a five out of five, he's got very strong feet. Then eversion, I'm gonna have you pull your toes out towards me. Don't let me push him in. Good, also a five out of five. So strength is great. Those are the range of motion and strength tests.